It's really easy to answer because um, when before we, we start with writing new songs, we sit all together with all band members and think about it and talk about it. What will we do on our next record? And um, we, we had the idea to do the development album from uh, the Revolution album uh, from 2004. This was the first album. We use uh, such um, electronic uh, stuff and instruments, and uh, we we need we, we used by Revolution much more dance, trance, keyboard samples and drum loops. And now we had the idea to do it uh, much more darker, and um, this is the reason why we choose EBM keyboards. And. Um, yeah, Elmar from Zentron, it's a German EBM band, is a very good friend of our singer Felix and our bass player Harold. And um, yeah, we, we asked him to work with us together because the EBM sounds are totally different as the sounds and, and the samples we used in the past. And uh, we think it's good when we, when we have some help uh, in the person which knows exactly how it has to be sound, what what uh, what what um, what can you do with the sample sounds and loops, and what what is our uh, the darker style, the EBM style, and especially Elma is also a really big crematory fan, and um, we said okay, then it fits perfect, and uh, we want to work together, but <laughs> the the the, prob the problem is that um, EBM music um, has not the lines or the, the, the structures we work with, with, with that in the past. Um, this means we started, um, yeah, two, two years ago, we start with the new songs. <clears throat> uh, at first, Elma, and I, I, I told El, uh, Elma, okay, you are a big crematory fan. Please write for me 10 crematory songs in EBM style. And um, this takes, I think, five or, or six months. And then we had, we had uh, 10 EBM songs, but not, um, not the style we have by Crematory. We have by Crematory, uh, for example, we have intro, uh, um, strophe, refrain, strophe, refrain, bridge, and, and this style. We have, <clears throat> the, the, the difficult thing was, that at first we have to arrange all completely all the stuff we get from Elma, and um, and after we arranged Elma's stuff, um, Catherine worked with him together about the keyboard lines, the melodies, the hook lines, and to, to do with Elma uh, together the whole keyboard arrangements. And this took also four or five months. And this, this means the first year we produced only keyboards, samples, and drum loops. And after, and after this was finished, then I get the stuff um, because Elma did only um, some techno bass drums, no real drums, only techno bass drums. And I have to work with this stuff um, to look where will I use real drums, where will I use the drum loops or were fits both and um yeah this was a big challenge for me as a drummer uh to to to, to especially work with, with with this both elements and yeah then i need i think two or three months uh, uh to work with with the drums and after that harold and matthias for bass and guitar get the songs and when they were finished then uh, felix uh, get the songs for making vocals and and Matthias, we it was it was really difficult because everything based on the EBM sounds and keyboards, and then we developed uh, each instrument for to the other, and this this is the way why it takes so long. We need two years uh, to write the songs, to arrange everything, and then to go in the studio to recording, mix, and mastering. 
and uh, uh, the first two years before or, or the whole time we played a lot of shows all over Europe uh, uh, for the Black Pearl's Best Of album we did and um, yeah we played a lot of shows then we have normal jobs we have families we have children um, yeah and we had no record deal because the, the deal was finished with Massacre Records that we, Mm, that means I need also time because I'm doing also the management. I need also a lot of time um, to talk with different record companies and uh, to deal with them. And we said, okay, we want to do us no stress. We have time, yeah, and we want to have a new great uh, partner, a good label, which um, is much more open minded. Uh, and which want to work with us together on the new crematory style, and yeah, then at the end we 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 uh, we get a good good partner with with Steam Hammer FPV, and then we make uh, we produce we go in the studio and produce the album recording mix and mastering, and um, then everything was fine. Um, this is this is the main thing from from our singer Felix. He's uh, the man which choose the title and which writes the lyrics and uh, which choose also the titles for the songs. Um, the special thing is that we want to have a name which fits in English and in German because we, because we use both languages on our album. We have German songs and we have English songs and uh, we want to have a title which is the same meaning in German like in English. Um, yeah, um, the, I think the main thing is at, at first, especially the, the work together with, with Elmar. Um, he bring in many new ideas, fresh sounds, um, because he's totally open-minded, but also know the roots of crematory. This was really, really important for us. And then, uh, for example, every musician of crematory is listening to a different style of music. For example, Harold is likes absolutely EBM music. Matthias is much more the trash metal fan. Felix likes much more the death metal, and I like much more pop and rock, yeah, or or or, 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 or some ways from the 80s, yeah. And um, and every band member bring in bring in the in, in the crematory music in his own influence. And then we had finished product with uh, uh, crematory. Yeah, this is, uh, if you believe, is, um, that shows you exactly what I told you before. If you believe is um, inspired by, by, especially by, the, by our guitar player, Matthias. And um, yeah, he, he prefers and likes more this style. I think that if you believe is, one of the traditional songs songs we had on the new album from 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 crematory it's it's not not too much electronic stuff like uh, for example like virus or, or shadow maker or so it's it's more traditional it's also a little bit electronic stuff but um it's more the traditional line of crematory We, 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 had, we had more songs in German, or where, where, where we switch between German and English in, inside the song. This is the, the only song I, I think. Uh, um, oh, virus, virus is also German, for example. Um, com, com, they are, um, it will be our second, uh, yeah, not really single, but we did two video clips. One for, for our single Shadow, Shadow Maker, and Compnea is the second video clip we want to release next week. Yes, it's it's um, it's a little bit doomy. This song, it's it's it, 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 it's doom. It's it's slower, and um, um, yeah, it's it's one of of our um, a little bit quiet songs, um, which um, yeah, which fits also very good. Um, this is the reason why we did it at the end of the album um, to um, to get an an an, an feeling. When the, when, the, when the record is finished, that you have a feeling from the whole album, but in a slower time that you can, um, that you can think about what happened on the whole record.
Yeah, virus is um, yeah, it's a spe special song from from, from me because um, I, I think virus is the this song who shows you the most the EBM influences. Um, it's it's a song where where we had a, a really hard mix between real drums and 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 uh, programmed drum loops and um, I I will I, I'm sure that that this song will also fit live very very good. We we ha we have since this year a new booking agency, and at this time we work together with him. Um, the, the the main problem is that we have all normal jobs and uh, families and children and 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 uh, that means that we 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 can't go really on tour. We only want to play some shows at the weekend, uh, Fridays, uh, Saturday and Sunday, um, and we want to play I think 25 or 30 shows um, this year. It's more. It's not possible. But um, I, I told the booking agency that he will book shows for the next two years and only the shows which are signed uh, perfectly, they are on our website. We had a lot of shows in the background which are not confirmed um, and we, will, we had a lot of offers uh, at this time and I think when the album is released we, we get much more offers. But um, we, we will be sure we will play the next two years all over Europe and, and also in France especially because that's Especially in France, uh, France and Italy, we, we get uh, a really, really good feedback uh, for our album. Yeah, it's a long time ago. I, I, can't, I don't remember when, when we played. I, I think it's four or five years uh, back that we played the last time in, in France. But the shows we played in France were uh, in, the, in, the, in the past were, were really good. And uh, yeah. We, we, we like especially the, the, the French food. <laughs> no, no, not really. Because, um, not, not for us, because we, we play everything real life. Um, Catherine is playing the keyboards and Catherine is also playing the sampler. She plays the sampler. There, there is no, uh, no machine which is uh, running in the background. And I and, and I play with, with some click track uh, uh, to the machine. No, uh, this is not the way we want to do. We want to play real life. That means Catherine uh, plays the normal keyboards, and she also plays the samples. For example, when when you have four beats in in in, in the in the chorus, then then she plays four times the same stuff. You understand? Yeah, um, but we prefer it much more to to play live. Then it's it's a different feeling as as when you are on stage and in the background is playing a machine, your whole stuff. Um, then then you can also sit at home and listen to the CD. That's not really live. Uh, what 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 we prefer. You know, it's uh, it's hard. We, we we start last week to practice the new songs in our practice room for 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 the. For the next concert, it starts in four weeks. We had the first show for the new album, and uh, yeah, we work hard on it, but um, everything works it's really good. Hello to our French fans. Here is Markov, the drummer of Crematory, and you are listening to United Rock Nation. Yeah. 